now tucked into sight. A lot of bouncing back and forth here from BBG. No final decisions, but now it seems like left. the A split is very much in the cards because A defense is in a little bit of trouble. Ah. Yeah, is holding in the corner, takes down the Lurker of Poach, and now you going right into Rhyme. So much utility that could be used just to read this out. No more paint shells to play with, but you hear all those zip lines going. Kusta off the long flank, eventually gets there. The trigger this one is good for the double, but your response. Eight seconds, have to make a play, and there's really not a lot of opportunity to do it. The spike will fall, and the last player, boy, even if you were to find eliminations, there was not enough. A little bit of yeah. missed utility on both sides, and both teams just kind of had to sit and hold their ground. Yeah, Boombot will come out now to start clearing middle. Nature tries to swing off a bit. Will is there to punish, but Rhyme and company now just stacking up a Tim Room, trying to take these fights out in the middle, trying to put those specters to use, but... You see some mid-aggression from Gibbon, but it's caught, and this looks like it's playing right into BBG's hands now. It's going to take a big play from Sean on B to change things. Yeah, just a couple of miscues through mid. Sean was trying to set up a guiding light peak for nature, but the timing was not quite perfect. So now it's down to Sean to kind of make a heroic play happen once again. Three last round with the Spectre, only one this time. And for Kusta up top, well... Finds his way into it and get some shots off. Sean has a chance to get some going with the flash. Timing may not favor him though, as Will again pops off with the Phantom on the ramps and gets a hand towards the defensive side of eight towers. Don Nakusa needs to get at least one here. There's the first, does it cleanly. Paint shells trying to push through it. Ah, tries to sneak over into the cyber cage, but Will's paint shells will deny it. Spike will be planted. Just no stopper, certainly gonna slow things down. Oh my, oh my. Yeah, Will gets everything he needs. Paint shells reset. Doesn't even need him. It's an ace from Will. And <laughs> very common. So yeah, you've got to play through mail here for BBG. But with that elimination from Gamon, that's going to be a rifle picked up. And nature's on this flank that BBG just do not expect. A yeah, good thing is BBG got B-Heaven control and kind of wrapped around that pressure in B-Lobby. And now they can even bring Spike through defensive side if they want to. Yeah, it's a great pickup from Poach over through Sewers. Spike will get planted four defensive back halls, and I feel like BBG navigated this pretty well. Slow Orb will come through. One to counter with the Flash, trying to delay as long as they possibly can, but Will, who was trying to play a timing, gets denied, and now you've got the wall bound. The Barrier Orb will, ooh, not actually quite allow the full defuse, or at least halfway defuse, but it doesn't make a difference. Gen G used that to essentially build themselves a more narrow choke point, and it's a thrifty round for Gen G. It's still coming on an A side, but... No, no one's really home. Boy's kind of playing more back, but now he just catches it and shuts down the trap wire. But Sean, looking for the aggressive P, gets the gunfight win versus Boy. That at least allows the defensive position to come through. And in the same moment, GMD wins a gunfight on the poach inside the Viper's Pit. So now the Flash has come through. Sean trying to follow up off of his own utility, but it's Kusta there to allow the trade. One more through. It's a cyber Cage, Bang able to get the Flash in, and that turns things to a 2v2. 30 seconds left. Oh, Will is tithing through the defense, not going through screens, and he would be correct in that sentiment. There's the barrel of one, finishes the kill, and the second! Bang for the double! BBG able to use the Red Bull clutch to keep it tied at three! Toxic screen goes up to try to get them a path forward, but they're just getting shut down by counter utility, and now Gamon's Vandal. Man, getting towards Vance, the only player on site defensively was Sean, and you just feel the numbers would have been fine. Feral Blazer early, just trying to clear things out, and Nebula will try to at least block the cross, but up top it's Sean, changing up the angles, goes one for one, Nature Deep will get a slow orb out, and that will be enough for BBG to just stake paws of their own. Uses the blast pack to push forward, he's got players to his left, players to his right, just guesses, and it actually boosts him back over to mail, but Bang finds the trade nonetheless. Now the Seeker's earned, those will immediately be pulled through, Nature can deal with two of the three, and now Will, for a rocket of his own, just a bit short. And now the defense on top of the site is going to be overwhelmed as Nature and Kusta have to reset and try to retake 2v4. Spike planted. Rhymes impact that middle, great cosmic divide, great use of their own showstopper to get B-Heaven control and push. Now on the other foot, we've got the ability for Gen G to also try to get a bit aggressive and the paint shells are getting elimination. Show already here for BBG, that wall is slowing them down. Now they'll try to wall over the top of it, but it's a two for one trade for Gen G. You like the sass of trying to make that work, but does not quite come to fruition the way that they were hoping. It's going to give a little bit of edge here for Genji. They seem to have a good B defense still in place to watch this B push as well. That's a great trailblazer. Should connect on the boy, but the Cosmo Divide may have paused the elimination. This poach moves forward. I'll tell you one. Boy, flashed. Not going to be able to find the gunfight versus Sean. We go 5-5. Five, five. Just fade. 
And well, Slow Orb will delay the flash as All well, right. but Bjorn still finds the elimination. Nature can kind of ordeals that happen where they get some good control, they get some favorable positions. Let's see if they can capitalize here as they're trying to fight their way through a ramp's good trade there. Limits Kusa to the one frag, they maintain man at least Spike is getting down, but as the resurrection comes through, Gen G have a chance to heal up and fully take this 4v4. Is this going to be down to do they recognize in time that this barrier orb is going to block them off the screens? It looks like they are pretty aware of it as they make their way over towards top tower. Defensively on the post plant. Hot to say the Seekers are going to scout things out, but it's going to be, at least you thought, Will maybe lining up a couple. Not the case. It's a two for one for Gen G. Now their attack on the way back into retake. It's one from each side. One up top. One through ramps, one through screens. Yours focusing on what's going to come through the nebula. Sees the blast pack of one. Nice shots, but then there's trades coming through. 1v1. Bang and GMD. Flash comes through. Bang gets the information plus the kill. And it's built by gamers. Up 6-5. Oh, boy. you got to be really careful here if you're pure. I love this. Oh, the oh, shot misses. misses. Sean was looking to play a bit of a trade setup. Not the case. So now all of a sudden it's a green light for BBG. Making their way on towards site. Two of them making their way up towards the top, so it's on Rhyme. How many shots can you hit here? Through the slow orb, not going to find anything else. And Kusta backside of the site also a bit of miss. With that, BBG will play it. Oh, man, I love the idea of the bait and switch there for Gen G, but the shots just miss, and BBG capitalized. Now spike down. That's the last utility from Will. Poach still has snake bites if he wants them. Take on the way. Nova Pulse comes through. Nature finds the first and does it very cleanly. Now around the backside corner. Boy's not here necessarily to help. Nature gets it, but... Just down to GMD and through the Viper's Pit. Too much of a distraction to find. Well, the Trailblazer sent through mid-map will get some recognition. That boy is playing pretty close to mail. Take on towards B, starting to make its way forward. Bang wants to try to deny mid-map, and that's a good elimination. But the problem is there are no defenders on towards sites. So the Barrier Orb will provide an avenue to get in, or will it? Now on the way down, BBG. A couple of good eliminations coming through. Slow Orb will completely isolate nature. Has to do something unbelievable, and nearly does. Three kills in the round for nature. Trailblazer will 100% scout this out, trying to assist deep. Got to pop off a couple, but it's like Gimon's not prepared for this. Yeah. <laughs> 100% is. Spike is not here, though. Keep that in mind, and look who is defensively uh -oh. cut this offense in half. Hold on. Never mind. Sean Never is going to find boys. Say, boy gets around and that corner. And it's gone! <laughs> <laughs> 30 seconds left. You missed the flash sale, I'm sorry. True. Oh, man. But for a second, Boy could have put himself in a really sure. slippery spot. Ah! Hey, fight! Do it! <laughs> oh, nope. Let's see if they can make something happen. Bjorn, of course, hearing the last back across, tries to surprise them with the judge. Does get one. Quickly traded. Will sees the pressure coming his way. Drops the paint shells to stall, trying to buy time, but he cannot escape. Back onto site. It's Seekers are out as well. Wait, these secrets. He was able to stand it and stay in the kitchen long enough to make sure they win here, forcing the save. Force regrowth to try to get Poach back up to full health. But Gomon will start to plant. Slow orb comes through, and Nature actually takes a fight in the middle of the poison cloud. Did not think he expected it to bloom when it did. So a good first kill for BBG on this retake. 5v4. Seekers come through. Sean denying two of the three. The play largely coming back up towards top tower. Kusa not 100% ready for it. It's another elimination for Poach. And now Sean down low is going to be tested from a multitude of angles. Able to help out. No, not quite enough. And how about it? BBG Gravity Well pulls the defense a little bit out of place. They don't have any B having control. That barrier there from Genji has denied that. Moonbot will now lead them into the B split. It's really just oh. one player in the back. But Will, that's a good little thought. Gets one and slows down the attack. Massively so. Boy's got a little bit of a reprieve here and uses it brilliantly. A double from Boy. Wanting the third up close and personal, tallies it, tries to stay alive through Rhyme. That's where the play will end, but it's a 1v3 for Rhyme. Paint shell still available. Two shots left. Needs to get this reload, so that's just to create some space. And the snake uh -oh. bite will push him out. Not a lot of time here. And PPG of overwhelmed. John's still feeling frisky. Wants to take this challenge. There is help here. Flash will come through. Uh, and Kusa looked like he was stuck inside of a spy cam or something. We'll still mount into trades. Resurrection for Bjorn will come through. And we got ourselves a 5v3 for BBG's defense. Yeah, it's looking swimmingly here for BBG to start working towards closing this thing out. Good shot there, though, from down. They're just kind of reinforcing that barrier with the ice wall now as well. It's Cosmic Divide, but none have moved as of yet. Rhyme in the close corner. 
Another toggle comes out. Exchanges start to unfold, but it all turns up in front of your Gen G. It's down to Will. 1v1. They get to 12 and map point. GMD on the cross gets the elimination and Gen G stay alive if only barely. So it's unfortunate, really, <laughs> but it is what it is. Oh, that was a solo play from Sean trying to pull the defense around. Two defenders are here, but a counter flash comes through. Trades on top of the B site. We'll allow Gen G on, plus the resurrection gets us to a 4v3 post plant situation. I know exactly. Decision of how you're going to clear this. They need to make that decision quickly. Time is starting to run out. Here comes the play. Boy holding close. Gravity Well comes out. Boy finds the first elimination. Kusa throwing shoulders. Sees no one's on spike, so Rhyme doesn't peek as of yet. Now the second challenge comes out. Rhyme with one elimination. Denied by Bjorn. Time a huge issue. Kusa in a clutch spot to hold this. And yeah, he'll just take the final two shots. A little bit of an A gather early here. Rhyme's not wasting any time with his showstopper, but kind of gets halted. Dueling oh. rockets, but Wills is the one that connects. On to Sean, a big player down for the attacking side of Gen G. Thing about this is there's still aggression here from Rhyme. Gets maybe a little bit caught on the rope. Still wants to take the gunfight. Finds the first oh my. and the second. He sides up to Bjorn with this operator trying to hold his ground, but he's been darted. They know exactly where he is. He's trying to swing some bullets out there nonetheless, but now he's getting pushed in. Oh! He lines up with collateral. That could change everything. Kusta trades, and now it's a two-on-two. -two. Oh, my goodness. And BBG are here to try to contest. Just comes down to what do you check? You see the defensive ping towards Rafter. In towards sight. Kusta timing on the peak. What does it look like? There's the first. The shots are not clean. Ryan able to get one. It's down to Will on the site. Stuck into a corner. Got banged him with that sheriff. Starts with this, though. You feel like that's kind of the X Factor moment. Just puts everything to a screeching halt and then bang. Defensive stack here for BBG, though, and Vance. This is the first time we've seen a look quite like this. Coach in the corner. No. Sean for one, and that will immediately force Will to back away. Yeah, this is one of the few rounds where Gen has been able to get man advantage this early. Good stun. Will can't get away. Sean, oh! good. Oh, it's Rhyme coming in off the flash of Sean. That is brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's oh. one and the second. Oh. Hold on nah. a second. No, 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 Surely no, 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 no. not. Surely no, not. Of course not. Oh, look, all these stars. Oh, my God. They're just playing chess with Astra stars. Not a lot of health to play with, not a lot of time to play with. Does see a barrel nah! boy, made this super interesting. Oh my goodness. <laughs> also deals with the trap wire, so not a lot of information here for Gen G off of that. But they are looking to get aggressive through Poach, who's been in this position before, and they'll go one for one, which largely that's fine. You see the cam placement from Kusta, that'll really kind of merit when you hit through, but the paint shells will force them out of the cam. Gravity ball comes down, and it's a trade that goes pinstripe in the kill feed. We stay to a 2v2. Not surprised to see it remain this tight when we've gotten this far. Now all the pressure on Gimon inside the B site here, getting attacked from two different angles. His teammate not there for support just yet. And back calls. Boy wins out the timing on the Nebula. Now these Rhyme alone. Still has paint shells available. Good shells. Yes. Oh, but Boy gets away from it. Oh, my. Wow. Changed, you know, the course of the round. Could have been a much different story there if Yamon finds Boy. It's a two on one. But again, that's just. All right, here we go. Gen G peeking through mid. Bang. Trying to get a Hawk to come through. BBG push. Gravity well. Vacuum Sean into the middle, but he's at least able to salvage some of this play. It's a two for one. Still favoring GG. Or BBG, rather. Knocking them. On the back. This and the thing spicy. is, Will was just looking this direction. But Bjorn, maybe he's done enough for the moment. Gets the first. Nebula fades. Bjorn gets another. Turns for the gunfight versus Sean. Time becoming a problem. The flash comes through. Sean has the challenge, but it's the pistol of Bjorn. Four in the round, and it's a four. It's just going to all come down to this exchange of utility right here at the AK a lot of the time. Good reveals coming through as the zero point to start things off. And then you thought for a moment, with BBG being revealed by... An Al drone on site that it was going to be a pretty quick cleanup, but Gamon, who was trying to push forward to execute the first kill, gets denied, and now all of a sudden, Gen G go back to the drawing board as they reattack towards mid, which Will is still kind of watching from yeah. double doors. Yeah, he's definitely going to be sitting here with the ghost, just listening in for this. They need to make sure that they are able to kind of swarm him. We do see Bang trying to put Godding Light out there to help Will out a little bit here, oh. but he's unable to dash away, get stuck Fight on the down, door, boy. Me. Does at least come out there with the classic and change. He's actually able to avoid that fragment a bit, and maybe he catches them off guard because of it. <laughs> it's kind of the trend. How about this? Flash through. 
The fence for oh, PBG wow. looking to get aggressive and take away the caves, and boy have they. Ace here on Breeze. No one's tournament life's on the line here. There is a lower bracket at this point, worth reminding you. Mm, as we do yep. see Rhyme come in here and get the entry onto Bang. Try to open some things up, evening the numbers. Ah, boy, nearly has a chance. With a couple of low health pulls in front of him. But Will will make the play through double doors. Reveal even going to turn on to Rhyme, which means that Poach can start throwing out some darts. They do go a bit awry, though. Not yeah. quite connecting, so maybe an opportunity for Rhyme to keep his life. And there's also help from Kusta as he makes his way onto site. Will slips in, though, between Pyramids, and I don't think that that really yeah. got picked up upon, and now Rhyme will get overwhelmed here on site. Pretty clean win for BBG on wow. a bonus, none. That's, oh, That's such a big miss. That's such a big miss. Ah, but the door will open up. Flash comes through. Gen G are still finding kills. Now the zero point will detect the last defensive member of Poach on the site. Seekers are coming through as Bang... I mean, I really feel like Rhyme almost got into some real trouble there. Yeah, I mean, it was really for me the fact that you, know, you get the smoke on the door. So we will get a little bit of connection here at the end of the round, but it will not likely amount to a post plant defusal. So it's just all kills from here. And I will say, though, for BBG, taking away these weapons oh my. is super valuable. Nature, oh the last good. one. Will could really blow this thing up. On the contact with Mon Poach. Goes the way of the defense. So that's. Position could be even more devastating. Oh, that's what is so good! Oh, but it gets canceled! Finish off and he kills because Will gets the kill from behind! And he only gets, what, maybe two of the darts off? I don't even know if he got the second bully. Kusta now stuck forward. Has to try to make something happen from this position. Rhyme looking to assist, but now it's just on to Rhyme. Darts come through and Will shut down to the... Operator for Will. Holding the angle. Sure, why not? Blade Storm. Up and over, Kusta. No, not will not be slow drone forward with the toxic screen starting to come through. This would have to be the execute. Not a part of it is Sean, by the way. He's still lurking left. around through B. The Aldrin does see one player over towards oh, double doors, but not a lot of information on what's actually on the side. So here comes the take. Boy able to find one, then spam into the toxic right cloud. Just down, gets blessed with a second, apparently. And nature just has to sit there and wait for, I don't even know what, just the end of the round, really. Yeah, I mean, Poach is already backed enough watching for maybe Sean making this play with the mid-push. And while Sean gets the kill, I mean, it it's really doesn't matter when you're still surviving with four members and you win the round and you're up 7-1. I mean, yep. I think the biggest issue with that Owl drone is it didn't find Boy. And Boy had maybe the most dangerous position on the site. To stop Jin you've got the Blades, you've got the tour, but Kusta still forces into a Spectre. I thought for sure that we were going to go Blade Sniper here just to help the economy. It's still a thrifty round setup that could potentially win, but... You shut down the null command, you get some bless up through the wall. Oh boy, just oh peak. There's a there's a kneecap. You wanna call it that off of Sean. Gets the kill. Does he expect the second though? That's the thing, and well, Ryan misses an opportunity. Same moment though. Kusta opposite side of the map has also found a kill of his own. The thing is this offensive take of Gen G is still not finding a lot of success. All the timing. Oh boy. Will does at least get that second kill anyway on nature, but he almost had a chance to get Rhyme down. Foot. Still alive somehow. Still alive somehow. Getting away. Shorty. <laughs> Alright, man. Yeah. Enemy wars. Okay. Okay. Problem Kusta, is he doesn't have a spike to work with. That is a problem. So with the clock being the biggest opponent here, it would have to be shots to connect. Kusta, do you still have an opportunity to find the last? Bang is nearby, uh, but he was instead playing for the operator pickup as a... Will's making the same route happen yep. that he did the first round of defense where he's already forward in mid. Reveal does come through, and boy, that will be a good elimination. Vipers that will come through. Yeah, Bang is big. the only remaining defender to try to hold, and it looks like they're going to set up for a post-plant retake. Yeah, now they had the luxury to watch for this flank because they have mana advantage and they have Vipers Pit down on site. This makes this flank from Will a little bit less likely to pan out the way that he wants to. The flash, though, comes through, but the timing's bad. And Will still gets his flank off, but now he's kind oh. of alone with Poach. But, I mean, they're getting their kills. They're back into a 2 on 2. Ah, but GMD in the corner. Not to be expected. Poach over the top. He sees wrong <laughs> players! Nobody watches the back at all! Oh my god! How does he do it? Chance for him backs away, and the fight will resolve into not much. But Bjor, through his own cyber cage, maybe an opportunity, but it's just a trade of information and a trade of kills that does favor Gen G. They're going to go for a quick plan, and this is the first good look we've seen from Gen G yet in the top offense. Yeah, this is one of the best executes they've had, aside from the one that they just lost on A site in the previous round. And it looks like this will maybe backfire a little bit on BBG calling that timeout. They let Gen G settle down a little bit, figure something out, go for a different play, and now they have a four-on-two post plant here. Not that it matters. I mean, BBG has such a 
yeah. strong lead that it would take a lot for them to cough this one up. And it's still not done yet. It's 2v2. True. Come on to the corner. That's his third elimination. Poach waiting for the slide out peak. Capitalizes, but it's Kusta in mid. We're up here. They're going to get aggressive here on the defense down middle. Oh. Racking that cage, bro. The flash, though, still allowing an opportunity for BBG to fight this back. Second flash now going to be pop. Bang wants to try to push for it. The aim is a little bit off. Oh, and no. That's allow enough time for Sean to come through and eventually put to rest what was a very scary gunfight. But even with that, BBG sneak on into the site with the help of Boy, and they get the plant off. They still have a chance to 3v4. They do, especially with Rhyme having low HP. It very easily could jump back into a three on three situation here. Dingy bunching up together, trying to clear up their close area, trying to get into A halls. They know that door is open. And that's a great kill from Rhyme. Will's got to find two here. It's the first. Ended. And I just got to find them all. Who's was the yeah. cleaning up boy. I Cam is, is supposed to be watching this. Oh, he's going to be frustrated when he wants. Fawn, though, Poach and company are kind of looking for him now. But now Sean's got assistance here from Cave. He'll find out Poach. And this gets really, really dangerous now for BBG. Oh, absolutely it does. Kusta did tally elimination in that battle over through the rope area events. Bang mid-map makes some use happen here. And if this kill on the flank is good, ah, not going to happen. I'll say maybe there's a chance for BBG to get into sight, and there still technically is. But Bang looks to be a 1v4 with 6 HP. 3 left to 5. What steps heard, though? Snakebite over the top. First 1v1 will be the one that he loses. They'll just... Fearless through mid map. Yeah, they're just walking a halls. This is the seekers though will detect this, and that's big news. Oh, but oh, you've got no. snipers on both sides of this. <laughs> Two are on one that gets the collat rhyme on the other, who gets a double. And it is oh a God. prime gaming flawless. So they would run to the op of rhyme, which could be a problem. Here comes the take. Will's already shut down. Boy, good for one, good for oh. two. Oh, my. The Sheriff will connect, and Boy says thanks very much for the scope. Viper's been also going to get called in. His poach is going to get the spike planted. That's big. They still have presence middle as well with Bang. If he gets in behind oh, Tunnel, this could this. just cap it off. Your timing perfect. Not going to get the double. Bang still trying to play off this flank. An exchange of weapons as Poach is the one who then tallies up the operator from behind, bang for one. It's a 1v1 situation. Nature on the boy. Shock dart comes through. Does connect touch on the boy. The problem here is starting to become the time. And also the decay, making this gunfight much easier for boy. Nature down to a single bullet worth the health, and that will do it. Man, that decay was... Yeah, it's just Rhyme. This is the second time he's played this position to open around, and it's been successful each time. It's kind of catching them off guard, you know. Even we and with BBG's forward pressure, they're again missing out on Rhyme mid map. Although maybe they're not. Post for a double mid. That's huge. And that's a go call to get on into a wall. Will go down, and the only defender to try to hold off against this will be Nature. Yeah, he's in a lot of trouble right now. Trailblazer comes through, clearing away. Didn't yeah, spot did. him in sight, though, so maybe he could actually pull the wool over their eyes a little bit here as they come up doors. No one's really looking at him. If you can get a couple of kills, they're still in the contest. That spike down, spamming for more against Bang. Neither really connecting the dots. This is getting real awkward. Bang finally he misses a sight on Will's barrel of his weapon. So now he's got to try to clear with the Operator in a 1v3, and timing not good. Oof. Will finding the kill, but my goodness, if Kusta finds that shot, it's a quick A look. Orb will be taken closer to Bladestorm is Will. Seekers will come through. Hunter's Fury now as Poach is trying to clear off the rampway, and he will be successful in that, but the counter coming through maybe actually stalls off this offense a little bit longer than maybe you thought. Unfortunately, though, for Gen G fans, Boy had pushed right through vents and clears off more than enough space to get this bike planted. Yeah, now it's going to be a tough 2 on 4 retake here for Gen G to try to stay in this upper bracket, stay in this best of three. The last they will drop down. Their tournament lies on the line at that point. Trying to set up the flank through A caves, but, I mean, they just have so much ground to cover. And there's a flank Ooh. of the flank coming around the back, although two good kills for Gen G. Will and Boy, 2v1. It's up to Rhyme. 
Full set of blades available. Time becoming a bit of a problem. Thinking about maybe trying to get this to half. Finds the one tap. It's a 1v1 with boy. No snake bite will connect here. He's through halfway. The blades, they do connect. Rhyme for four in a 2v4 situation that Gen G. How does BBG throw away a four versus two post plant? You just can't. You can't allow that to happen. Not as tight as this game's been. That was your moment. You had it right there in your hands, and you let it yep. slip through. I mean, for all the praise you have to give Rhyme for his antics and his success, you do have through to... this. Rhyme also revealed he'll be oh. dealt with, and okay, clean take starting to come through. All of a sudden, built by gamers get possession of the site. And Nature gets flashed as well, so he's trying to hold this angle, but he's not allowed. Toxic Stream comes down. Sean and Nature, though, still able to find a couple of kills, but it's short-lived. It's now all on Sean to try to see if he can keep this one strung along. Spike yet to go down, but of course it'll be easily planted. The thing is, wants to. Go ahead. Sean took that little double hop up towards Platt. And I don't know if they saw him go back down, so now it's individual angles being held. But no, Will locks down.